Hey, doctor. Hello, Peter. I'll be just a minute. Wow. Look at all this new stuff. We really need to get better about orc. Where did you get all this equipment? Called in every last favor. Took out a few loans. It's like we're starting over once again. But this time's going to be different. Electro was the first legit super-powered villain I fought. Till then, it had been regular guys in fancy suits. Last time I fought Scorpion, he asked if I knew what my skull looked like from the inside. Then offered to show me. Super fun guy. Gonna miss that humorless grimace. Vulture might be the smartest guy up on this wall. Not smart enough to duck three consecutive life sentences, of course, but still pretty brainy. You've been busy. Just getting started. You know, until now, we've been looking at prosthetics from the wrong perspective. Why restore people to what they were when we can make them better? Okay, I think that should do it. You ready? Everything okay? Damn it! This is all your fault, Norman, you son of a... Well, I know who you're not voting for in the next election. Sorry. I, uh, have a habit of making bad jokes in tense situations. <laughs> uh, it was a good joke, Parker. Just a bit of an overreaction on my part. No, don't worry. Uh, why don't you take a break? I'll, uh, I'll clean this up and uh, get us ready for another test. So, uh, hope you don't mind me asking, but it seems you and Norman have a bit of a history. We were lab partners in college. Became friends. Decided to start a business. We both had visions of changing the world just in different ways. Wait, you were at Oscorp when it started? I'm half the reason it's called Oscorp. In grad school, everyone called us the O's. <sighs> Add Corp to that and, well, it is a catchy name. Well, why'd you leave? Norman became more and more obsessed with genetics. He started a project I considered unethical. And there was this... Anyway, lawyers got involved. I chose to leave in exchange for a settlement. But that money didn't last very long. I've relied on grants ever since. If this project doesn't work... Don't worry. It'll work. Uh, let, me, let me just fix this up. I'll brew some fresh coffee. Be sure to run a diagnostic on the control unit. Could be a short.
Oh, why don't you do the honors this time? I think we did it. Next step, neural interface. That's a lot of work for you to do by yourself. Sure you can handle it? Apparently not, judging by today's debacle. Because I still haven't found another job. My funds are still... I know. It's okay. Don't worry, I'll figure it out. What's a few bucks when you're trying to change the world, right? To changing the world. I missed a call from MJ. Doctor, I need to go, but I'll be back later. Don't worry, the work will still be here when you get back. What's that? Hey, sorry I missed your call. We still on for dinner? Dinner? Oh, yeah. I was calling you about something else, but yeah, we should talk over dinner. Offer still stands for me to come over and cook. Oh, really? Well, I like to take risks. I'm still out, but I'll grab some stuff at the store and let you know when I'm home. Okay, talk soon. All right, dinner at MJ's. No expectations. It'll be hard to screw this one up. I guess I'll just freelance for a while until she calls. All units, 1043, mass terrorists have eaten the civilian bus. Nearby officers, please proceed to the West Village. is really behind all this. Black Cat's been here. She was doing this in person the first time I caught her. Or did she catch me? This can't just be some elaborate flirtation. Hasn't she heard of dating apps? She's up to something.
Another cat. That's Ty Stone's place. And it's full of priceless art. You're playing with fire, Felicia. But I guess that's how you roll. to be amazed. You are not gonna believe what happened. So you know that address you gave me? I went there. MJ. I know, I know, but wait. What is this? Just listen. This is the address Pete found. Men are all carrying firearms. What is this place? That office. Might be something inside that connects this to Lee. Need to get back there. Huh? What was that? What dumbass can't put their shit away? Bet it was happy. Martin Lee's really paying the boss. Yo, Rick! Boss wants to talk to you. Get in here! Yeah. You need to get into that office. Lee, but Lee finances the boss's new venture. Win win. You better clean your slag off that sloppy well. What are they building? Is this all for Lee? Only samples. Boss is still perfecting the recipe. Let's go to kick. Was that? The hell was that? Grave dust must have me on edge. Hey, what was that? Someone there. Easy does it. What kind of vehicle needs tires this big? Where is it? I swear I left it over here. Yo, who's there? Yo, has anyone seen the 316 socket driver? Big 
your death mess with me. Why don't we get a new recip song? That guy's not going anywhere. Maybe I can distract him. Hey, anyone pick up more beer after our last run? Hardware? Office must be to my right. Need to move careful through here. Yo, man. Why's the boss being so intense about putting GPS trackers on everything? Protecting trade secrets. Doesn't want any word on grave dust leaking out. Still, feels paranoid. Those barrels seem important. Alchemax. Why is that so familiar? Who asked you? What's in these? Fuck! Come on! We'll never know this! Tombstone. You're right, Rick. Won't notice? Cause it won't be there! God damn it! I said I'll fix it! You got some stones, Rick. <laughs> Let's see if they break. Such a disappointment. And now I need a new welder. Blueprints. An APC. This is what they're building for Lee. But why does he need an arm? Here we go. GPS trackers. What is Tombstone using these for? All right, boys. Time to move. Get the gear for my office. Time to go. Okay, I want to say don't ever do that again, but since I know you're going to anyway... Here. Take a few of those next time. Nice. Thanks. You know Tombstone is crazy and pretty much invincible, right? Everybody has their weakness. Mine is... whatever you're cooking right now. <laughs> it smells amazing. The chicken curry. Uh, just needs some time to simmer. No dumplings, I hope. You're never gonna let me live that one down, are you? Nope. <laughs> the great dumpling catastrophe. I still can't believe they evacuated the entire building. I know, and in January, too. <laughs> Your neighbors hated me. Yeah, they were pretty happy when we broke up. <laughs> yeah. So, let's talk about what you found in Lee's office. Well, Lee clearly has issues with Norman Osborne. Yeah, but, but why? I don't know yet. But his next move looks like it involves devil's breath, whatever that is. Yeah. I'll dig into it. So I was thinking, what if we teamed up? What, what you want to be my sidekick? Like a spider girl? Spider woman? No. Woman. No, not a sidekick. A 
partner. Oh. Not again. Hey, it's your crime system thingy. Looks like a residential break-in. Charles Standish. Hmm. That sounds familiar. Oh, Oscorp CFO. Wait. You don't think this has anything to do with Lee, do you? Sorry to cook and run. Did... Did you just leave your clothes on the kitchen floor? Uh... Where do you want me to, uh... Just a couch is fine. <laughs> See you later? Yeah. Hey, it's me. This curry is legit. So what do we know about Charles Sandish? Let's see. Chief Financial Officer at Oscorp. Single. Known for his art collection. If Lee's after him, it's gotta be related to Devil's Breath. I'll run a search on everything in that file. Let me know the second you find something. I think Lee might be planning something even worse than City Hall. So, are we partners now? Because it sure feels like we are. Partners? Sounds good. Okay. See ya, partner. <laughs> Police look like they could use some help. There's probably more of them inside. You guys stay here. Somebody was in a hurry. Spider-Man! You're hurt. I'm okay. But you gotta find Mr. Standish, fast. Those guys in the masks kidnapped him and forced him up to his place. He lives in the penthouse, top floor. Okay, sit tight. Sell it, huh? So glad you're here. I can't find my car. I could have sworn I parked on this level. Ding! <laughs> 
work here too? This building is serious about parking enforcement. Good fight. A for effort. The elevator won't work. They know I'm here. But maybe I can sneak up through the elevator shaft. <gasps> Should be able to make it up to the penthouse from here. <gasps> Standish. Okay, now what? Enter your password. He sounds nervous. Maybe I should take him out.
Alter GT. Lights out. <laughs> Good one, Pete. Nap time. it off. Okay, all clear. Hope Standish is all right. Try this again. It's safe now. What were they after? Just financial records. About Devil's Breath? How do you know about that? Why do they want it? I don't even know what it is. Mr. Osborne's been pouring money into it for years, but he keeps the whole project a secret. I'm the only one who has any record of it. Not anymore. Looks like they copied some records to a secure server. Payroll information. On a Dr. Isaac Delaney. Who is he? I, I honestly don't know. Down! <laughs> <laughs> Get 
You okay? Yeah. I think so. Good. Good. You know, as elevator shafts go, this is pretty nice. Hey, Yuri. You okay? Yeah, but I didn't get much out of Standish before these Sable guys stepped in and told me to back off. What's the deal? I get the sense all they care about is keeping him quiet. Because he knows about Devil's Breath. Right, whatever the hell that is. I'm working on that. I think I just got a lead. A lead? You sound like a cop. Don't you mean spider cop? Uh, Yuri? That's fair. Peter, what happened with Standish? He's safe. Okay, good. And the demons? They were looking for a name. You got a pen? Yeah, go. Dr. Isaac Delaney. Okay. Who is he? What's his deal? I was hoping you could tell me. I'm on it. Just give me a few. Oh, and before I forget, you left that tracker from Tombstones at my place. I'll drop it at Dr. Octavius' lab. Let you know what I find on Delaney. Felicia thinks she's toying with me, but I learned something in each of these scenes. Aha. I think some big-time lawyer lives here. I bet she's after his client list to find new targets. Hate to admit it, but she's one smart cat. Hey, do you have time to check something out for me? No, but if you ask nicely. Just got a call about a suspicious-looking box on a rooftop in Hell's Kitchen. I could call in the bomb squad, but if it's just some kid's science project... Yeah, I know. Budget crisis. Yada, yada, yada. So? Uh, will you please check it out? There's the magic word. I hope it's some kid's science project. Man, I miss those days. The school projects are so much easier than real life projects. Mass Terrace with a bomb. Officers needed on scene in Rosevale. 